I agreed to do the leadership series because, yeah, once I heard about it, I thought it would be a great opportunity just to share some of the experiences I've had. I, I came to Birmingham 20 odd years ago, and this I thought was an opportunity to share some of my experiences of how I've been able to get ahead in my career and uh, potentially help a cohort of MBA students. I actually had my arm twisted by uh, one of the former alumni, a lady called Scylla Snowball, who works for our advertising agency. So she's got me increasingly involved in what the university does. For instance, I'm doing part of the mentoring programme at the moment, so uh, Silly persuaded me it would be a really good idea to come and give a talk. Well, in the first place, I was flattered and honoured to be invited to do it, and uh, I think telling the story of what I've been done over the last 30 years is quite fun for me and quite interesting for people, and I quite enjoy the idea of helping people think about their own careers and mentoring, in the longer term, people who have got similar aspirations. It's a, it's a wonderful opportunity to uh, actually reflect now on uh, a little over eight years of um, leading Belfort BT. What I hope to get out of today is really not something you're necessarily straight away, but to find out in five years from now or ten years from now, somebody goes in through LinkedIn or whatever's taken over from it by then, and somebody says, you know that day you came to Birmingham and you spoke about, you know, sort of the leadership of change and the difference in the public and private sector, that really inspired me to go on and now I'm doing something absolutely sensational, you know, that somebody just keeps in touch and it really makes them do something they didn't think was possible. I think sort of the realities of uh, the perception of leadership and uh, which uh, certainly the view I'll be taking is that it's quite a lot different from the perception. When I came to think about what I was going to say, I thought, I, I actually reflected back on my career and started to think about some of the things, so it helped me think about back my career and how I saw it, and I hope I managed to communicate that to people and say something of interest for them that they might take forward in some future world. I think any discussion with a group of highly intelligent people, particularly with an international background, always leads you to challenge your own thinking. What a great opportunity to come back to um, where I graduated more than 30 years ago and to uh, just reflect back on that. If there's something I can give back to students of today, then it would be a great thing and hopefully inspire somebody.